Hi, this is Steve. Welcome back to Scale Model Kit Review. In this video, I continue to build the Agora Models Terminator T800. I am on pack number four. Pack number four arrived very nicely here in their new boxes that they ship these out in. And inside this box are contained 10 issues. So in a moment, we'll go on to the bench and I'll show you all those issues along with the articles that are contained within the magazine. Yes, you do receive a magazine with this subscription. So if you haven't done so already, head over to Agora Models and subscribe to this kit today. It's fantastic. It's beautiful. Uh, you know, I can't, can't describe anything more than that. And it's been a lot of fun to build. Also, with Agora's promise, they promise to... Uh, once they come out with a kit, they're not going to stop in midterm and leave you hanging. You're going to get the whole kit as you want. Now you can do like I do. You can subscribe to uh, receiving 10 issues a month. Or you can pick the way you want to have your subscription. You could probably buy the whole kit at once if you wanted. Just contact Agora Models about that. So without further ado, let's get started. Plasma rifle in the 40 watt range. The Uzi 9mm. I'll be back. Welcome back. Here's the magazine for pack 4. You can also download this on their site if needed. Now, remember I said there's going to be 10 stages contained within this magazine and within this pack. Um, we're going to go ahead and concentrate on stage 31 with this. So when I show you the magazine, I'm going to show you the build instructions for stage 31, and I'm going to show you the rest of the magazine. Also, after I show you the magazine, I'm going to show you all the parts for all 10 stages, and then we'll get started with the build. So as I open this up, you can see the table of contents lists all the stages on the left, left here. And they talk about their community, uh, their online forum for this build, where you can go there and ask all types of questions. Very interactive forum, too. Also on their website, they're very interactive there, too, where they can answer your questions live in a, in a little chat window from their website. So with stage uh, 31, we fit the left shoulder accessories and add joints for the right shoulder. And we'll gather our parts from the previous stages and start assembling more components on this. And like always, you're going to need to have some really good super glue for this build. And all the screws are normally pre-threaded, so lubrication isn't normally required. But if you find yourself having to lubricate the parts, that's okay too. I normally use Vaseline for that. And we go all the way up to, we have about 11 steps with this stage. So, let me move forward in the magazine. They always give us a few articles in the back. An article here about RoboCop. Um, the success of the Terminator directly led to the violent near-future satire of RoboCop. So that's pretty cool there. So we have four pages of, of RoboCop, and then we get into police and military drones, a cyborg in disguise. And uh, I have myself a DJI drone, which I plan on premiering here very soon with you all when I can uh, uh, hit some of the places of interest that have to deal with scale modeling. So stay tuned for that on my channel. So, let's go ahead and look at all the parts. And here's the first five stages, 31, 32, 33, 34, and 35. Let's look at 31. Here's 31. Let's 
Here's 32. Here's 33. Here's 34. And here's 35. Let's look at the next five. And here's parts pack 36, 37, 38, 39, and 40. Here's 36. Here's 37. Here's 38. Here's 39. And lastly, here's Parts Pack 40. Let's get started on Parts Pack 31. So, let me go ahead and take these out. We'll get a closer look, and then we'll begin this assembly. Here's a close-up of the parts. We have the left shoulder blade. We have the left shoulder fitting shaft, or the fixing shaft. We have the left shoulder blade fixing cap. We have the plastic liner, the right shoulder insert, the right shoulder joint, and the left shoulder accessory. Also, we're going to need to have the left shoulder assembly from stage 30. So let's get started. And here's most of everything you'll need for this build. Of course, you'll need the instructions on the right there. And you'll need uh, something to apply your uh, super glue to. I usually use these little, little shot cups you can pick up at any of your uh, grocery stores. Um, and some super glue accelerator. Also the glue looper to apply my super glue with and two screwdrivers. I use the PHO or the PHOO screwdriver. The PHO is the one the bigger one and it works a little bit better. And you may actually want to have to use a, a vise, a little mini vise, a pan vise. So I highly recommend this tool too in your arsenal. And also for this build, you're also going to want to gather your extra screws that you saved during the build, and that's this right here. Remember, you can find all this stuff on my Amazon store, and I'll put a link below where you can access and order these parts and these tools for yourself. For step one, we're going to install this plastic insert into the shoulder here. And it simply goes in like that, push it down, make sure it fishes flush on both sides. Next we'll take the shoulder joint itself and make sure it's configured correctly where it looks just like that and not that way but like that and we're going to insert that just like that. Also paying attention to that assembly right there. Note that the top shoulder blade is close to the one raised detail on the shoulder assembly and that's the, this right here. Okay, Just like that. 
we have the opening here. Now we'll insert the pin here. We want to line up the hole. That's going in very smoothly. And we'll press that in. And there it is, it's flush in. Took a little bit of hoaxing, but there it is. And the other side, of course, we're going to go ahead and install our cap. And this is a flush fit here. You shouldn't have to use any glue on it. There's a couple of alignment tabs on that side. There's the alignment tabs, and we'll just press it in, just like that. Next, I'll get my super glue ready. And we have this accessory, and it has a little cutout notch right there. We're going to put some super glue on that. And if you look closely at the shoulder on the top here, there's a, an insert, but there is a little cutout. And the cutout is towards where these lines are. So we'll insert that in, just like that. I think I'll throw a little more super glue in there. And once again, facing down, just like that. And I'll hit it with some accelerator. And that will make it dry a little faster for us. And lastly, we'll glue this part onto the shoulder assembly. And uh, we'll go ahead and hit it around those areas there. That should be enough glue. Press it in there. Perfect. And I'll just go ahead and hit it with some accelerator on the back side. And it should dry just fine. And that completes stage 31. So stand by for stage 32 coming up here very shortly. That was a lot of fun. And uh, looks like we pretty much have both of the shoulders almost complete here. Let me get the other shoulder out. So if you see here, here's the other shoulder. We have the right shoulder. And this is the left shoulder here. This is the right shoulder. Pretty cool, pretty cool.
So if you like this video, please give me a thumbs up. Please subscribe to my channel. I can use all the subscribers possible. And hit the bell for all notifications. Head over to Agora Models and subscribe to this kit today. It's fantastic. Happy modeling, everybody, and take care.